Once I've created an analysis in Stat Graphics, it's very common to want to take the output and copy it someplace else, perhaps to Word or Excel or PowerPoint. That's very easy to do. All you need to do is go to the table or graph that you want to copy. Double click first to make it large. Then if it's a table, you could copy the entire output by simply pressing the right mouse button and choosing copy. Or you could highlight a section of the output, just the section you wanted, then press right mouse and choose copy. Once you've put that on the Windows clipboard, you can then go and call up another program, perhaps Word. And in a blank page in Word, press the right mouse button and choose paste. There is the output for you, uh, nicely formatted the same way it was in Stack Graphics. You can also copy graphs. If I go back to Stat Graphics, I can go and pick up a graph. First, I'll double click to make it large. Then I'll press the right mouse button, choose copy. Go back to Word, go down a little bit below my table, press right mouse, paste again. Graphs are pasted into Word or PowerPoint or Excel as objects, so you can actually resize them, move them around, and so forth. A couple other special things to know. Let's go back to that numerical output for a moment. You'll notice, for example, a table of coefficients. Let's highlight that table, press the right mouse button, and choose Copy. Now let's call up Excel for a moment. And once we get into an empty data sheet in Excel, press the right mouse button again, and this time choose Paste. What you'll notice when things are pasted in, in Excel is they're actually pasted into the cells the way you'd like them to be. Text comes in as text, numeric values come in numeric so that they can actually be picked up and used in formulas. You can also save graphs created in Stack Graphics as files on disk. To do this, you go to the graph, push the right mouse button, and down near the bottom of the pop-up, choose Save Graph. Graphs can be saved as Windows Meta files, as JPEG files, as TIFF files, encapsulated PostScript, uh, and other formats. All you need to do is give your graph a name, curve fit or something like that. Choose the type you want, perhaps JPEG, and press Save. This will save the graph as an image file, which you could later embed in maybe an HTML document or send to a printer for publication.